1979, my parents started Flying Fish Company in my hometown in northern Idaho, and my dad was a, a flight instructor for small Cessna planes. So it's only about 350 miles from Sandpoint to Seattle. So he'd bring back a box of fish from Seattle and sell that fish in Sandpoint. Um, so it was Flying Fish Company. So as a kid, I grew up around fish and a fish market. My mission is to give people an incredible experience with seafood. It's gotta be memorable. And then secondarily is the story behind where it is that your food is coming from. I get the question all the time when I have a customer that asks for red snapper or they ask for tilapia. I say, you know, nah, that's not something I carry very often because we're right here in the Northwest and I have this wonderful sustainable fish uh, that's the local Pacific rockfish that you can purchase or even a lingcod that's a wonderful ground fish caught right off here off the Oregon coast that's such a better choice than tilapia or red snapper from the Gulf that has variable sustainability uh, over the years. So um, my sustainable alternative to your tilapia that you're asking for is our local rockfish or lingcod or petrali sole that we catch right off here off the, off the Pacific coast. And they're all delicious, sustainable choices and you can tell them about it and most of them will go with it. So I look at sustainability in the sense of, are you being mindful with your choices? If we all just think just a little bit about where our food is coming from, then I think that without any third party certification or any, any of the other sustainability qualifications, just general mindfulness, like, is that good, is that good? I'm gonna go here. And most of the time I think humans are pretty good 